Good morning, Hoover Math and Science Academy students and staff. Hi, this is Akil coming to you live from your WHVR studio. Today is Friday, March 9, 2018. The temperature in the village of Schaumburg is currently 23 degrees. Later today, we're expecting a high of 38 and a low of 24 with sunny skies. Now please stand and join us in saying our nation's pledge. Our pledge people for, for today are... Sophia. Arthi. Christian. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. In sports, the Blackhawks won against the Carolina Hurricanes with a score of 3-2, to two, and the Bulls will play the Detroit Pistons tonight at 6. In preseason baseball, the Cubs won against the San, San Diego Padres with a score of 10-4, to four, and the Sox lost to the Kansas City Royals with a score of 12-0. to zero. There are no clubs meeting today. Today's announcements are... Are you interested in learning about planting vegetables and flowers and working in a garden? Then Garden Club's the place to be. Permission slips for this club can be found by the music room and must be turned in to Miss Young by March 21st. Now a message from Mrs. Ankrum and Miss Canoon. Good morning, wonderful, lovely Hoover staff and students. Happy Friday. We have lots of announcements today, so we're going to move um, a little bit quickly. But we Well, wait. Welcome back. Okay. Mrs. Anchor, we missed you yesterday. <laughs> there was an empty, sad chair there. It was kind of sad, know. so I'm glad you're back. I am so glad to be My back. My mic is not on, so let's get that on. Okay. There we go. Jumping right in. It is so um, nice to be back. Thank you. I was a little under the weather yesterday, so it's good to be here. But we did talk about if either of us miss for next time, we're going to get a stick with our heads on it so that we don't feel so alone. Um, <laughs> all right. So let's jump in and get started. So today is, well, this is kind of fun. It's National Get Over It Day. So if there is something that's been lingering or you're holding on to or just something you can't get over, today is your day to just let it go. So again, it is National Get Over It Day. Um, <laughs> National Barbie Day, those of you that love Barbies. Mm -hmm. I still have a Barbie from when I was growing up. Oh, yes, I loved Barbies. Yes. Um, and then it's also, well, National Meatball Day, but we're going to give you some facts later on that. So more to come on that. Um, something really excited, exciting is that WLS Channel 7 will feature room 207 6th grader Nithya M's picture on the Weather Sketcher segment of the Channel 7 News at about 5.30 Monday morning on March 12th. So please make sure you tune into the news on that day and congratulations to Nithya. It's pretty awesome. Very awesome. Mm -hmm. What an honor. Um, we have a few staff members that we would like to recognize with their You've Been Framed. And we have Miss Solar, and some of the words that are said about her are fun, energetic, flexible, caring, sweet, thoughtful, and calm. Very Thank nice. You. And then we have Mrs. Mee Goot, who is nice, smart, caring, helpful, innovative, patient, friendly, kind, and a hard worker. So awesome. We love all the staff members that we have here at Hoover. So blessed. And we're going to announce our Smensel winners. Um, please do not go down to the office until announcements are over. We have Jeremy in 106. We have Dina in room 202. Gabby in 202. Addison in room 206. Ken, Kenan in 102. And Lexi in room 101. Congratulations on that. Whoops. And then we're going to pull some Herbies. Here we go. Okay, I have the intermediate egg. Ms. Canoon has primary. I think it's 
Tita in 202. In 202. And we have Vasir in 126. Oh, and I pulled him twice. Oh, I did too. We have Gabby in 202. Alyssa in 209. Let me mix them up a bit. Um, Eileen in 121. Leslie in 204. And Caitlin in 112. Fabi in 207. Um, Anya? No, no, Mina. Room 109, Manva. All right, Monty in 207. Ryan in room 109. Patricia in 207. Logan in 101. All right, we'll each pull one more. Okay. Ahmad in 205. And Neved in 110. All right, congratulations on those. And then we want, ah, this keeps <laughs> We keep <falling. laughs> Thank goodness it's Friday. Um, Miss Reschke, come on up. Yeah, you can stand behind us. Okay. And she has a special announcement for us today. And she loves, loves, loves being on the camera. She is so excited <laughs> for this. This is my so. first time. Uh -huh. It's fun, isn't yes, it? Yes, Mary. Mm -hmm. So, hey, Hoover. I'm here to remind you that next Friday, a week from today, is Hoover's Around the World at Hoover, our multicultural night. So that's where we have lots of fun activities, like the origami is normally a big hit, and lots of yummy food, Chinese food, Indian food, Japanese food. There's even going to be pizza this year. And lots of the students here at Hoover are going to be performing, doing dances, singing songs. So we want to remind you to mark your calendars to come out for this very fun night. Next Friday. Thank you. Next and Friday, yes. March 16th, 5.30 to 7.00. Perfect. Thank, Thank you, you Mrs. Ladies. Rushke. You yeah. did an awesome job. Mm -hmm. And we're going to have Miss Chavez up here, Mrs. Kozak here yeah. next week. <laughs> yeah. So they can't wait. So when you see them in the hallway, say, can't wait to see on TV. Yeah. All right, ladies. It's the time. Take it away. <laughs> Friday's fact is, today's meatball day. Nearly every major c culture has its own version of the meatball. They can be an appetizer, a side dish, or the star of the meal. Meatballs can be served with spaghetti and tomato sauce, covered in brown gra gravy stuffed between crunchy bread, or served in hot soup to celebrate cook up your favorite meatballs or go out and order some from a restaurant near you. That's all for today. This week's broadcast has been brought to you by the Bubbly Bu Buffalo production team. Have a fishy French Fry Friday.